హలో ఐ ఎమ్ హారిక అన్ ఆపరేషన్స్ ఇంజనీర్ హీర్ అట్ ద ఏడబ్ల్యూఎస్ ఆఫీస్ ఇన్ నాట్ ఇన్ వర్జీనియా టుడే ఐఎమ్ గోయింగ్ టు షో యూ హౌ టు రైజ్ ఎ స్కెడ్యూల్ ఆర్ఎఫ్సి లెట్స్ గెట్ స్టార్టెడ్ లెట్స్ గో త్రూ ద స్టెప్స్ టు క్రియేట్ ఎ స్కెడ్యూల్ ఆర్ఎఫ్సి యూజింగ్ ద ఏడబ్ల్యూఎస్ మేనేజ్ సర్వీసెస్ కన్సోల్ ఫస్ట్ ఆఫ్ ఆల్ లాగ్ ఇన్ టు ద ఏడబ్ల్యూఎస్ మేనేజ్మెంట్ కన్సోల్ ఆఫ్టర్ లాగింగ్ ఇన్ టు ద ఏడబ్ల్యూఎస్ మేనేజ్మెంట్ కన్సోల్ నావిగేట్ టు ద మేనేజ్ సర్వీసెస్ కన్సోల్ Now select the RFCs option from the left menu. Choose create RFC button on top right corner. There are two options to choose from when selecting the appropriate change type. You can select either browse change types or select by category. Here we'll use select by category. For example purpose, we'll be raising a management other other RFC. This means that I'll select category as management sub category as other item as other and then operation as update then I'll choose next now on this page you must configure request by providing the general configuration we will enter the rfc subject we can use this later to filter the rfcs if needed by using the rfc subject now we'll enter an email id for email notifications while this is an optional step any email addresses provided here will receive notifications when the status of the rfc changes for this demo i'll leave it as a blank we can also provide more details regarding this change in scheduling there are two options one is asap which means that rfc will be performed immediately on priority basis the other option is scheduled which means that the rfc will be performed based on the scheduled time we will select the second option here that is schedule this change because we choose schedule we must then select the date from the calendar icon in the box note that the start date must be 24 hours from the current time if you choose the current date you can't proceed to next step fill in the time using hh:mm format this is the start time of the rfc note that we are not providing an end time here the maintenance window duration is 4 hours by default so the rfc end time is 4 hours from the start time choose time zone from the drop down list Note the additional configurations, they are optional. Choose next. Provide details in comment box. Choose the priority from the drop down list. Your choices are high, medium or low. Provide the resource ID related to change. For this example, we'll use an instance ID. Note. You can always return to previous page by choosing previous to verify or update any values. Choose create. The scheduled RFC is successfully created. Note that you can track this RFC by the RFC ID. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.